Yeah, who does that? Who raised your ass? Who raised you? Seriously. Piece of trash. Whoa. This dasher is pissed. Rightfully so. There he goes, walking in. Hi, uh, again. Uh, I delivered food here yesterday from Chipotle. Mm -hmm. And you put down that I didn't deliver it to you. Because I just got fired from my job. Yeah, it was you. This is my only source of income. I do this all day. Now I'm fired from my job. Because you want your $10 burrito? No. Are you out of your mind? Who does this? Who does that? So this DoorDash driver goes in to a place that he had delivered to the day before. He confronts the girl behind the counter who was the customer. She ordered from Chipotle and scammed the driver. You got me fired. Like, I need the corporate number or something. Because I, I need to get your ass fired. Does anyone have a corporate number? You have one? Yeah, yeah. All right, you want to say that you got your food? I'll contact them, but... But what? Did you... Like, did you get your food or what? How are you? Hi. I even called my lawyer. He told me I can call the cops because it's theft. <laughs> it's theft. Are you going to say you got your food or not? Or should I call the cops? You Because you're stealing. I'm not stealing. Yeah, yeah, you are stealing. Regardless of what the situation is, we all know stealing is wrong. And that's what she did. She stole. She stole from DoorDash. She stole from the driver. And she stole from the restaurant. Yeah, who does that? Who raised your ass? Who raised you? Seriously. Piece of trash. Now you could see that he goes on and starts questioning her upbringing. That's what you are. Trash. Are you the, are you the manager? Can I help you? Yeah, I delivered food here yesterday from Chipotle on DoorDash. I DoorDash all day. That's my main source of income. That's all I do. And this girl, I delivered it to her. And then she went on DoorDash and put down the I didn't deliver it here. So then I this morning I wake up to go DoorDash and I'm fired because of her. Because she said I didn't deliver it. I would never do that. I had it right to her. That's the girl. Is there a corporate number I can call or something? Because you guys have thieves working we here. Give you, a phone number here. you have thieves working here. Now, in my personal opinion, for him to go as far and try and call corporate where she works to get her fired might be taking it a little bit too far. But you might be saying, Pete, an eye for an eye, right? You did something to me, I'm going to do something to you. If you guys believe in the universe and how things work, you know that saying, what goes around comes around? I'm sure things came around for this DoorDash customer. In my opinion, this DoorDash driver has every right to be upset. But if we learned anything from years ago with the CVS woman that did the same thing, we know that the Dasher is usually going to get fired for this kind of a thing or deactivated in this case. So drivers, Dashers, in the comments section down below, tell me, do you think what the DoorDash driver did in this video was right or wrong? And secondly, would you actually go and confront a customer yourself? Let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. And if you made it to this point in the video, leave a comment saying driver 345. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button, turn on the notifications and hit that like. The link to the original video will be down below. If you have a video you want to send to me to be featured in an upcoming video, email it to paidtodrivestories at gmail.com. This video has been brought to you by the Paid to Drive membership program. Get started today by clicking the join button now.